Some things, as history has illustrated, best left to their slumber. I speak in riddles. I talk of the stricken wolf ship. Ah, the U-boat episode. Miss Croft would never enlighten me as to the details. For my own protection, she would often stress. Indeed, Winston. And for this, you should be grateful. Deep in the bowels of their vessels lay one of the most powerful artifacts in all Christendom. An artifact which, when wielded at the vanguard of an army, would make that army invincible. The Spear of Destiny. But the boat never reached the fatherland with its precious cargo. It disappeared from radar three weeks into the journey. Seamen, and also something much more sinister. The Zapadnaya Litsa port, once the pride of the Russian fleet. XKGB, the majority of them, trained killers. Dealt with mafioso before. Unpleasant memories. Prefer to avoid them whenever possible. Yes, I would prefer this also. Hardly a major search party, is it? There's something you're not telling me. Ah, yes. I'm a big girl now. Hit me with the bad news. It is bad news. The Admiral's allegiance has been bought, and under his command, a nuclear submarine. It's housed in one of the dockyards. Well done. Nuclear submarine. Sounds nice. Perfect holiday. Lara, wait. Take this tracking device. What's this? You're not worried about me. Yes, somebody has to. Touching. But don't wait up.
such extortionate prices for incompetence. You forget, Mikhailov. I am still an admiral of the Russian Navy, and as such, demand respect. While you accept my bribes for use of the submarine, you are under my employ, and will follow my instructions without complaint. 
If I deal with the like of you to keep my men in bread, it does not make me one of you. Ha <laughs> ha! Relax, my friend. We are two sides of the same coin. Mafioso filth. Brusiev, hurry on with that box. Our new commander demands efficiency. Enough, enough! Board and seal hatches! As you have promoted me to commander, is it not fitting to board before the Admiral?
economy class. An unwelcome addition to our little assignment. Leonid, if you would escort this lady to the brig. Your little assignment? You have no idea what your Mafia financed assignment is, do you, Admiral? Young lady, who you are and what you know is of very little concern to me. If I was captain of my ship, I might listen to you. But unfortunately, the situation I find myself in doesn't allow me that privilege. So if you would be quiet and hurry along like a good little girl, We are 
car before the stricken U-boat. Now we find if its cargo is still intact. Prepare your divers. And are we to be told what we search for? Enough to locate it, da, but beyond that I fear it may be too much for your limited intellect to grasp. Perhaps too much for my trusted comrade, but perhaps not for this spy we have located on board. A spy? I trust you disposed of him. Not him, her! Yes, we are forced to run with the wolves, but we shall not kill indiscriminately like they. Fool! I shall dispose of her when I return. Move the sub to position quickly, comrade. Take her five degrees astern, quarter power, and bring her to a full stop. Attention all dive crews! Report to your stations immediately!
I'm an art visitor. I fear you have an item in your possession that I require. To be used in your continuing quest for world peace, I presume. World peace, not entirely my purpose in pursuing this artifact. This artifact contains untold power. Power of which the likes of you will never harness. If you wish it, you may have it. But you will regret it. The world may regret it. Hand it to me and I may spare you. On your head be it. Take her to the torpedo room and eject her into the ocean. <laughs> Sergei, listen to me. You don't know what you're dealing with.
He infect my ship with his greed. And now we are all doomed. We have a chance. The escape pod, come on. I'll help you. I do this only to help my men. He babbles of the biblical spear, and I feed his madness for money to feed our families. And now, to these corpses left for the fishes. Yarofem, I can help you, but you must help me. The ship is about to impact into the ocean bed, and then our time is up. We must hurry. <laughs> Escape pods have no internal air supply. You will find the oxygen tanks in my stateroom. I hear my ship dying. The internal seams are <coughs> splintering.
breached, and we will drown soon. With the oxygen, you escape now. Not without you. I am Admiral Yarovev of the Russian Imperial Navy. I have served my great country for many years, but the country I know withers. The bear lies down to sleep for its final time, and I wish also this fate on the ship I have grown to love. No deal. Yes, deal. For the outer airlock can only be opened from inside the ship. This is my gift to your child. I release you to a future beyond this dying vessel. And my gift to you? Tell my story. Tell how the proud men of the Russian Navy fought against the enemy from inside and sacrifice their lives for that their country may once again stand proud. You have my word. I salute you. Quickly, into the airlock, and I will release you. Goodbye, Admiral. saw enough of the power of this artifact to recognize its rightful place was where man could never again misuse it. And not enough for it to destroy her. Some powers are beyond the wit of man. Oh dear, gentlemen, I do apologize. It seems someone up above has a sense of humor. If you will excuse me a moment, I shall fetch candles. It is a night spurred by hell. And as the horsemen drove ever onwards across the world, the heavens boiled in their wake. Ah, benefits of a religious education.